Good stuff. Thanks, Annie. Time to check in with Mike Yanni again. Mike filling in for Jill today. She's under the weather, hanging out at the Young People's Theater. He's putting on his gadget guy hat right now. Uh, good to see you again, Mike. Talking about some cool tech ideas for the holidays. That's right. And I'm not acting this time. This is truly some of my favorite stuff uh, for the holiday season. Lots of stuff to get to. And I want to start with this. This is one of my favorite devices on the market here for the avid reader on your list. Ebook readers are fantastic. And this is my favorite one. This is the Amazon, the Kindle Paperweight. Uh, it is really ultra light. Of course, it's touch screen. It's got the glow, easy to read. But I love these because especially if you travel or if you take transit, uh, you can download thousands of books right on here um, and uh, actually the one of the things I like about the Kindles is that some of them have 3G so no matter where you are as long as you have cell phone service you can download books in a matter of minutes so if you're at the airport and you can't connect to Wi-Fi or anything like that uh, you can download all your books to that without any additional cost so I love that you book readers are always a great gift moving on when it comes to MP3 players, there really is only one choice on the market, and it, it comes down to Apple's iPods. A uh, wide variety to choose from. Of course, you have the uh, iPod Shuffle, the tiny little guy, perfect if you're into running or things like that. The Nano, which has a touch screen, and the iPod Touch. Um, these are great for kids who want to play games and apps and listen to music at the same time, uh, because essentially it is an iPhone without the phone uh, built in. Uh, these are all the uh, product red, so a portion of the sales uh, of this goes to uh, AIDS research in Africa. And of course, if you're going to get an iPod or a phone or something like that, you want to get cases and there's lots of cool cases and I was talking about Product Red, um, Apple has all their red cases out right now and as I said, uh, it's for a good cause. So if you like red, uh, this is uh, these are the cases to get. This is really fun for the, the younger uh, mindset. These are other cases for uh, the iPods and the iPhones and even the iPads. These are Belkin Lego Builder cases. So it looks like a, a normal case on the front, but of course when you turn it around, you have this Lego pad uh, so you can actually get little bricks and you you can create your own case and customize your own case and kids can have a lot of fun with that. Just a way to personalize their device and kind of make it feel like, like it's theirs. And they're, they're decently priced, they go from about $30 and up. This, everyone uh, here has been wondering what this is. This looks like just a normal cube, right? But I'll turn that around and it'll, it should light up there. This is actually a dice. It's called Dice Plus and the idea is this actually talks to tablets, either an Android tablet or an iPad, uh, and you can play virtual board games, but you still have a physical dice to roll. That's one of the problems when you're doing board games on an iPad or something like that. It just doesn't feel the same, right? But with Dice Plus now, uh, you can connect to it and you can actually roll the physical dice, uh, which is a lot of fun. That's kind of cool. This, okay, if you have a gamer in your home, especially younger gamers, they, a lot of them like uploading videos of their gameplay to YouTube. YouTube. This is a must-have device for you. This is the Roxio GameCap HD Pro. Uh, what you do is you hook this up to your Xbox 360 or PlayStation 3, and it will work uh, shortly with PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, and you can actually record all the gameplay to your laptop. It even works with HDMI. These are great. Kids love these things uh, because, especially when it comes to Minecraft, things like that, they like putting walkthroughs online, so it's big with the, uh, the younger set. This is one of my favorite toys by far. This is called Anki Drive. And Anki Drive is, you remember slot cars? This is kind of like an upgraded version of slot cars. You place this down on this special mat down there, uh, and they have artificial intelligence built into the car, so it knows to stay on the track. And uh, it works with your iPhone or your iPad, specifically for iOS devices. This is exclusive to the Apple Store. Um, and it's really cool because you have virtual weapons. So they will stay on the track. You don't have to worry about it, but then you can take out other cars, and multiple people can play at the same time. Uh, it's a lot of fun. And last but not least, for the guys on your list, uh, if you have a beer Maybe they still haven't shaved off their uh, their mows, their mustaches from November. This is cool. This is the Philips Style Expert. But what's neat about this, this is a beard trimmer. But this is what makes it special right there. I don't know if you can see that. There is a laser guy laser. built in. Lasers. Lasers are, make everything cool. And so you can actually get those perfect lines when you're trimming your beard. <laughs> it's only 99 bucks, so it's a cool stocking stuffer for the guy on your list. There you go. Good stuff. Mike, you're going to put all this on your blog, right? It will all be on the blog. Good stuff. Breakfasttelevision.ca. Click on blogs. Look for our gadget guy, Mike Yanni, and all the information will be there. Good stuff. Thank you, Mike. We'll check in with you. Find out how our Young People's Theater uh, rehearsals are going for the big production that starts tonight, I believe. Uh,